The problem with the breakdown of a relationship is you're often left with a feeling of having unfinished business, unresolved issues, things that you didn't say, things that you wanted to make clear, um, things that you wanted to rant and rave about. And the problem is that if you try to deal with these in everyday life, what might happen is that you moan to your kids about it, not going to be helpful for them, they need to feel positive about their other parent. You could end up by blurting some of the, the issues that you have, the angst that you have out when you're doing the handover with the children. Again, not a good idea, often happens. Um, you could end up by taking various forms of revenge or you know, trying to tell everybody, including all your mutual friends, etc., etc., his family, whatever. And the problem with that is that it can often get you into more trouble, really not resolve the issues, but just perpetuate them. So what I help people to do is, even if they're not in front of their ex, I help people to reach a place of resolution, a place of completion, if you like. And it's amazing how effective it is, even if the person that you're talking to isn't there, actually getting it off your chest, and we've got some really, really good tips and techniques for doing that. And again, the forgiveness process is one of those, so that you're all clear, you're all straight, you've said your piece, you've said what you're still sad about, you've said what you think they, you added to their lives, you've said why you often got angry with them, you've said what you regret, perhaps. Now, the interesting thing is the person doesn't need to hear this, but once you've expressed it, it's then possible to move on and create a totally different relationship with them because it has to be a totally different relationship with them. You will always be connected if you have children. You will always need to communicate with that person. So I can help you to actually express what you still need to say. It's a little bit like having the last word, but in a safe and controlled environment. So it doesn't hurt anyone, it doesn't damage you, and it doesn't damage your children.